Hey everybody, I'm Jessica Trueblood and I'm the original underachiever here, um, founder of the group. We were doing a thread today in the group on shop banners, which was very fun and I was so excited to see everybody's creativity. Um, and a couple of people asked about how to make a free shop banner. So I thought I would do a quick video here so that you can see um, where you can make one. There are other options. In addition to Canva, I think there are other places to make them. And if you have the measurements, you can make them pretty much on any platform. Um, Canva is free and it is fairly intuitive to make a banner once you learn how to navigate Canva. So when I go in, you're gonna create a design and I just start with Etsy shop cover. So this is the shop cover. It's not called a banner, but it's called a cover. And you can see here that when you get to the screen, there are tons of pre-made um, pre templates here. And if you're not very comfortable with Canva or with graphic design, this is a great place to start because you can take one of these templates and make it your own, swapping out the photos and the colors. If you wanna start from scratch, you certainly can here and put your own images and logo into it. But if you want to grab, let's say, um, what I usually do is try to find one that fits the aesthetic and the ideal customer that the shop has, and then you would come in and make it your own with Canva. It's really important to change the design elements because these are templates that anyone has access to. And it could be that other shops are using this same, the same template. So I always like to be original if I can. Um, I just come in, if I'm using a Canva template, um, you might wanna come in first and you can see how I clicked on this and then went to this color square and it lets you change colors here. You can change pretty much everything about the template um, if you like. Okay, whoops, undo. You can make it bigger. So if you want this to be more eye-catching, you can do that. And then this would be where you could put, you know, the name of the shop, for example. You could put down here, um, you know, something that says what your shop does. You can come in and change up here's where you would change the font or the font color. Okay, you can change the size. And then you would just want to play with these elements until you, this one's actually kind of cute, I like it. Um, change the elements until you were really happy with it. You can make this. Okay, that did not work out. Um, I'm by no means a Canva expert. I know there are lots of people in the group that know this program really well. So I'm sure they'd be happy to answer questions. Okay, that's not working. Never mind. I'll leave that alone. So as you can see, um, you could also upload your logo here and put it somewhere in the corner. And when you're done, you just download it here and it'll save to your computer. Then when you go to Etsy, you go to settings, <clears throat> info and appearance. <clears throat> and this is where you can upload your logo. This is um, a different banner. Upload your shop icon, receipt banner. Yeah, that shows up on the... Okay, now I can't find it. Oh, actually, I know where it is. You go back to go to your shop, edit shop. You can come to here and you can add your image where we just downloaded it to your computer, you would simply browse your computer and upload the file. And then you want to check it on a computer screen as well as a phone screen to make sure that it's full size and that nothing has become blurry when, um, when you uploaded it. Okay, thanks.